I want to make my grandma soak this for the dry comfort like um, five um, days now because I'm going to use blender to blend it. This is the one I'm blending. I blended already before I remember to make the video. So I'm blending with my with my big jar blender. Very strong because my my blend, other blender cannot blend this for me. So I have to bring out this bigger one for it to help me give me the smoother one I want to blend. So I will show you every process I'm taking in this I'm making a facam. I just put the corn into blender. I'm going to add enough water, you know, so it will blend very well. Because the blender will not give you everything like that of the machine. But allow your corn to be soft so we make it and um, give you what you want so i'll go ahead and blend it before start i'll start them um, sieving i finish blending i finish blending this go ahead to fix it together okay i'm going to use this bigger pot and this is the sieve i'm going to use you can use any bigger any chiffon you have but this is the one I will be using to sieve it. You go ahead to tie, to tie it under. You tie it very wide so when you are sieving it, it will not disturb your head. And start sieving. I'll go ahead and start sieving it. So yeah. Since I don't have a happy hand, I have to pause the video guys. You just be sieving little by little just to get the shelf I have to pause the video you'll be using water adding more water to sieve it to get the chaff but I'll get back I'll show you for the final result at the end okay because I'm busy with my hand no one to help me I'll I'll show you what the hand look like here is the chaff I got from it. Here is the chaff. I don't know what they use the chaff for. So if you know whatever thing you can use this chaff to do. So people feed it for their chicken. But I don't think I can use it for anything. I'll just throw it away. Here is the chaff I got from it. After blending. I think my blender did a good job. Some people can re-blend it but I don't think I need it. I'm not need of the blending. So I finish saving it. I'm done saving, so I'll go ahead and allow it to settle down before I pour it inside another bag that will remove the water. So I'll go ahead and allow it to settle down. When it's still done, the water, the hot water will be so clear. So I'll just cover it for settlement. I'll leave it to the following day on. You can do it tomorrow, but I'll leave it tomorrow morning so I'll remove the water. Then pour it inside a bath for it to so allow it to settle down. So I'm going to allow it to settle over the night so I'll allow it to. I'm going to remove the excess. I'll be pouring it inside this bag because so the water and when it's a heavy something on top of it. This is it. I'll place a heavy something on top. Go ahead and place the and place there is something out of profit. 